A Yukon lawmaker partnered with the Oklahoma Second Amendment Association to host an event this week in assisting teachers with getting a license to carry a handgun. News 9's Angelicia Bruton has more about this training class and what students think this will mean for campus safety. Representative Jay Stegall says he wants to use his store and skills to make a difference in Oklahoma schools. Well, there have been a lot of incidents from coast to coast and we're all trying to figure out what we can do to help that situation. As a gun owner, a firearms store owner, and a firearms instructor, as well as a state legislator, I wanted to make sure that I was making available all the tools that I had to help arm those that protect our kids, even if they're not on school grounds. Oklahoma state law says school districts can allow teachers and staff to carry if they have a valid armed security guard license or a valid reserve peace officer certification. That person must also be designated by the Board of Education. This is, again, that first step in getting the license that's required by state law. Uh, it provides a, a really good background of the law uh, as it applies to those who carry in the state of Oklahoma. The requirements that have to be met, the training standards are also in state law. Cloverleaf Precisions offering an eight-hour course and hands-on training. Most of the folks that are going to carry on campus are going to carry concealed so that no one actually sees that. So there's no reason to be nervous. Most kids in Oklahoma grew up around firearms. But some students tell me this does make them nervous. Not everyone is meant to be a police officer. Not everyone is meant to save a life. And I definitely think that trying to give the persona that teachers should be heroes is the wrong thing to do. And giving a gun to the wrong person can definitely end more lives and save any. Rather than investing in our teachers and teaching them to teach, we want to teach them to shoot guns, which is completely backwards because the problem starts with mental health. Stegall says he's received messages from some teachers wanting this training. This isn't going to help those that want to carry just on, on school grounds and meet the criteria as far as state law is concerned there, but it also helped them in their daily lives. Angelicia Bruton, Oklahoma Zone, News 9.